Hi, we're researchers from Drexel University. Our study is designing alerts on cognitive aids used in time-critical medical settings. Prior work has suggested integrating decision support into the existing systems. Cognitive aids such as digital checklists can help track task completion and can reduce errors and influence team communication. Decision support alerts are also used to improve clinical outcomes, but the poor design of the alerts could lead to alert fatigue. In this work, we explore how decision support alerts could be designed for cognitive aids in critical care settings by using a digital checklist for pediatric trauma resuscitation. We interviewed 11 trauma team leaders using the four alert designs on our digital checklist. The pre-arrival alerts appear on the top of the pre-possible form as users document patient context information before the patient's arrival. The banner alerts will show up in yellow at the top of the screen. The inside screen shows the list of alerts with variables behind each alert. Users can use tabs to switch between the inside screen and the main screen. Finally, pop-up alerts appear with a button to dismiss, also containing the variables. In the interviews, participants highlighted that the pre-arrival alert design showcased the alerts without obstructing use of the form. They also liked being able to prepare for the case by viewing the alerts before patient arrival. However, participants noted that missing information could hinder the quality of the alerts. While discussing the banner alert design, participants appreciated that this design was not obtrusive, but noted its diminished visibility. Participants liked that the insight screen would serve as a reference point throughout the case, but were worried about switching to another screen to view alerts. Finally, participants had polarized opinions of the pop-up alert design. Some participants liked this design because it would grab their attention, while others were worried it would affect their use of the checklist and distract from clinical thinking. From our findings, we discussed three design implications for alerts on cognitive aids used in time-critical team-based medical events. First, the alert design should balance visibility and intrusiveness. Our participants highlighted that alerts should be noticeable visually without blocking use of the aid. Second, our findings highlight the need to consider the relationship between patterns of cognitive aid use and alert design, as alert design may need to differ based on how the aid is used and the stage in the medical event. Finally, the alerts need to include the appropriate information, with the user supported in sharing this information with the wider team. We will explore these design implications further in our future work.